let's take a look at this problem. We're given some x and y values, and based upon that, we want to first find the regression equation. So let's go plug these in the calculator. Now, just to make sure your calculator is set up correctly, go and make sure your diagnostics is on. And how we do that is we do second zero to go into the catalog, and then we're going to push the what looks like x to negative 1 button. That's actually our inverse button. And that'll take you down to the D's. Or you can just simply do a down arrow over and over until you find diagnostics on. Anyway, I'm going to keep on going down. And I went too far. And we want diagnostic on, and press enter, and then enter again. It won't do anything exciting, it'll say done. Now, you only have to do this one time, so don't keep redoing it each time on every problem. Okay, so let's go into stat, go into edit, and let's go and put our numbers in. Okay, so for our x values, we'll put those in our first list, so 1 through 8. I'm pressing enter after each one of these. Okay. Now I'll go over to L2, and that's where I put my y values. So I got 12 and 21. So 12 enter, 21 enter, 25 enter, 32 enter, 41 enter, 45 enter, 81 enter, and 93 enter. And, um, double check some of my numbers. Now I'll exit out, do second mode. Okay, find the regression equation. I'm going to press my stat button, right arrow to calc, and I want to choose the fourth one linear regression. Press enter on it, and then press enter again. Okay, so our regression equation is y hat. And uh, I said two decimal places, so um, we're going to plug in this a value into this y is equal to ax plus b. Well, we're rounded two decimal places, that's 11.14. So 11.14x. And then we'll plug in this b value in for b. And it's uh, negative 6.39 to two decimal places. Now how you enter that in is you'll type in y hat equals 11.14x minus 6.39 and that's our first answer now the second thing it's asking for is using the model from part one predict y when x is equal to 15 well what we're going to do if I can get back to the there it is okay that's, uh, that's the first thing second thing is we're going to predict what y is going to be. Now, y hat is a prediction. When um, x is 15. So we'll plug 15 in for the x. Minus 6.39. And we'll see what that is here in a minute. On our calculator, it's also asking for the coefficient determination, which is r squared, which is 0.8933. So the answer to that last one is 0.8933. Now for this one, let's plug that in, see what we get. 11.14 times 15 minus 6.39. And press enter. And we get 160.71. Now, um, notice here, answer form, I say it's just a number, but I say round two decimal places. So this is the two decimal places we're fine there. And our last one, the coefficient determination, I say round to four decimal places. And we took it four decimal places, so that's fine. So those would be our answers.